Hello, everybody. It is Denise B. Povernick, and I am the CEO's Secret Weapon, and I am an energetic experience alchemist. I bring you to the experience of how powerful your energy is to transform your personal life, your relationships, your business, so many different ways that we can experience how amazing life is. And today I have the honor and pleasure all day long at the top of every hour to interview some of my amazing clients who have become my friends. Uh, and just share their journey, how working together has changed both of our lives uh, for the better. So with me this hour, I have the amazing Elizabeth Schneider Peel. She is the CEO of Global Medallion, and she uh, first came into our environment in January with the January pod of the Invincible CEO Elite Program. It was a six-month program. We finished up, I believe, mid-July. So welcome. Welcome, Elizabeth. I am so thrilled that you are here. You have amazing energy. You just went through our two-day personal CEO energetic experience on Zoom. So I'm going to allow you to just, just share who you are, what you do, and then we'll get into the questions of how working together has, has changed things for you. Thank you so much. It's truly an honor to be here and certainly to have had the experience of being in your space and your energy for the last six months. Um, when we first met, it was actually through another event and our paths sort of separated, but I don't know why or how, but the universe just put us back together again. Um, I am, um, as Denise said, I am the CEO and founder of Global Medallion. We are luxury travel concierge. This company is started as um, a product of my love of travel and that I've um, in a transition point in my life I have just finished a 32 year marriage with my business partner John who I will always love we pride ourselves that we have a compassionate divorce but we've just grown in different directions my divorce became final in October so it was just the perfect time when Denise came into my life because I am at the stage, um, our 35 year old company in the computer business with John is winding down. If I were to choose, I could quote retire, but I have too much inner energy and too much love and passion of the travel business not to, I've, I've done it freelance for so many years in the Orlando, Florida area, uh, which is the tourism capital of the world. Having been a French teacher for a number of years in high school French, my contract wasn't renewed and I went with the flow and what do I want to do with my life? I really don't want to become a French teacher again. And the opportunity presented itself to become a tour guide with French groups coming into the central Florida area. So my, my life, I guess, has just leveled up so much since Denise has come into my circle both on a business level as well as a personal level. Um, in this process of de, um, disengaging with John, as I say, we still have the, the uh, computer business together and other business involvements, but we are officially divorced and navigating this, uh, this fine line. Um, and so I'm in a transition both on a personal level and on a business level. The Global Medallion is sort of on the launch pad ready to go for launch. Kennedy Space Center, the NASA program, the universe, the heavens has always been my passion. So I'm going to be incorporating that within my global medallion um, purview of, of extraordinary experiences. But I digress. The, the role that Denise has played in my life has just, um, number one, reaffirmed that what I've made life choices and sometimes because of the stories and the, the mental chatter, chatter, oh, you should have stayed a French teacher, look where your life has been, and 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 start to self-chastise. But by recognizing to trust that little voice within, stop the words, stop the talk, get back to what you feel inside, this is what Denise has taught me. And, and I'm trying to apply it both in personal and in business life, um, that basically we're here just to be happy and 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 enjoy the journey. Um, yeah. In fact, that's my little tagline with Global Medallion, journey happier. Yes. Life, life delivers all sorts of things. And, and, the, and by tapping into your own energy, you, you attract that sort of same energy vibration. And Denise has the unbelievably beautiful way of helping, or at least for me, open up that little tight bud that I knew was in there and just needs continual expansion. And, and her her wisdom, her use of words and, and dissecting words that brings it so simplistic. It, it's not easy, but it, 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 it's simple. 
Mm-hmm. And if we can get back to simple, because sometimes we complicate our lives. And so um, the the analogies, the, the lessons, um, it's just that the elite program, although six months and meeting three times a week was intense, it was so beneficial. And growing on um, one stage to another, and Denise has a wonderful way of reincorporating um, past lessons. One of the things you learn is that you learn through repetition, ceremony, and what you feel. And through the process of repetition, you need to break old patterns, old stories, old habits. And her way of helping you carve that path um, has, at least for me, just been so opening and um, reassuring and has helped me grow in both personally and with the business. And um, she helps you create the space in your own heart and mind and in your different energy chakras and and she she keeps it there for you as you're learning to become that caterpillar that's breaking out of the the cocoon and and become the the butterfly and she's helped there to help you along the way and um then the yesterday the two day uh, intensive was just an amazing re reinforcement through repetition of much of what we learned in the elite program i would highly recommend anybody who is going through life questions, both personally and on business level. Denise is just an amazing um, conduit to get to where you can find inner peace and harmony. So thank you. I have a question for you. What do you feel, because you've done other programs with other coaches before, what made the Invincible CEO Elite Program different for you? The contact with you personally. It was not, you know, yes, there are, you have an amazing library of videos and YouTubes and tangible fill out forms, which I love. And, um, and my life is so filled with so much. I'm so blessed never to be bored um, that I don't have the time or I, I choose not to devote the time to that because other things in life are taking priority at that moment. Nonetheless, that wealth of information is there for those who choose to go to that resource. And I like knowing I have that safety net to all of a sudden just need a, need a spark of Denise and can go to the YouTube channel or go to our Facebook page. Although Denise knows and is working with me. I'm, um, I'm old school. I'm a dinosaur (laughs) at 65. I'm learning Facebook and social media and I know I need to, but still, um, I deal better with personal relationships, seeing her, having her available, um, to have that interaction, that's where the energy flows. So that's what's been different because with other programs, you start off with the, I don't want to say the coach, but the the person that you're looking to as your your guidance, and then it becomes impersonal. Um, You become one of a larger group and um, things just are um, sometimes muddied in the water for some of the older or not the older but th- those who are more veteran in the program and and then you just sort of get lost in the shuffle so i am so grateful for denise's personal one-on-one touch she believes in small groups because that's how you interact better not that there's there's a, an energy with a large group too don't get me wrong but right. that denise's accessibility um and 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 personal energy flow so so it's often said that uh, by my clients and 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 you guys become personal friends to me. So uh, they they often say to me that they hear my voice in their head during the course of their day when we're not interacting. So have you ever had any of those moments where you hear me going, oh, what are you doing? Or oh, something? yes. Yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Or, but of course. But of course, right? But Catherine? of course. But of course, that's that's the that's the mantra, yeah. and um, and uh, uh, as I think I've told you personally, and um, others may know, during the course of these sessions, I try to sit in front of my computer and scribe the um, the lessons uh, during um, the pods of the elite program. Denise does record it, so you can go back in um, and review it. But for me, the actual tactile touch of the keyboards, I, I can actually type faster than I could try to write it, but that act of trying to extract and at the same time write it down and then have that to go back to and see how my notes, and I miss a lot of words and typos and what have you, but the energy is there. And because it's real time, it re-evokes that, um, 
the lesson or the feel or how some of the um, the trainings that we use, you know, hands-on, direct, um, experiential forms to um, to learn that that lesson. I know from my experience of teaching French, it becomes very boring learning. Uh, um, verbs conjugation but if you could put it into a little song that people remember you learn so much better by the, by the experience by using different um processes of the of the immediate human senses touch taste smell feel um what am i missing uh, yeah yeah, all, food, food, taste, yeah. Taste, smell. so was exactly. there any big aha moments for you uh, either in the Invincible CEO Elite Program or in the two-day free event that we just finished up in the energy sessions? Was there any aha moments? So many. Um, I think the last one we're in, we, um, after many exercises over the, the two days, um, we were tasked to go into our imagination and see, well, first of all, we felt, we, we, we brought into our mindset a time or times in our life where we felt successful, where we felt energized, whether on a personal or on a business level, and to re um, reignite those um, those feels within yourself, and and by using breathing techniques and um, drinking a lot of water, both water and the oxygen are are the conduits for energy flow. So uh, with that, I'll take a sip of my water. <laughs> yep. Yes, get that water in. And I'm just putting in the comment section. If anyone who is watching has any comments for you, please put them in the section, uh, the comment section, and, and we'll ask them to you so that you can answer them in your own words. So go ahead. More about the so, 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 the, so we, after having gone through that experience of um, reigniting uh, some feel good times where we felt proud or happy or content within our life, then to project it with whatever our personal um, desire, goal, end result. And um, by uh, creating and imagining going up in an elevator to reach that point. And when you go in that elevator, it's your present self. And at the, the rooftop is that future self. And in that, that, that um, escalating of the, the elevator to the rooftop, um, and doing it slowly, feeling the different stages of that feel that you had at that moment of um, pride or contentment and, and success in your life. And then you know, project it onto that person that is you waiting to reach you at the top of the roof at, when yeah. the elevator door opens. That was very powerful for me. And, um, and it sort of paralleled something that we had done through the elite program, putting kind of a, a dream vision board together. And I had cut out a, a painting, a, you know, a, a, I guess a design ad from a magazine. I don't know where I found it, but it sort of paralleled that. And I was able to kind of merge myself, uh, my present self into that persona of who perhaps I come across as. And it just is the blending of the two for for um, ready to take off because there's a plane on the rooftop kind of in a, in a go position. So, That's, so I think it's very uh, symbolic. Yes, and, it was, yeah. And, and I'm so excited because you are going to be, we're having a uh, multi-day event in Florida in November. So you are my uh, travel agent person that, that is going to help me put this event together with Andrea and Moira. Uh, so not only are you a client and a friend, but we do business with each other. Uh, so excited about what you're putting together, the energy that you bring. So with all that's going on right now and all the craziness out there in those outer circles, how has these programs and these experiences helped you be the eye of the storm, the calm amongst what's going on in this world right now? Um, I'm so grateful that you have um, expressed that level of um, ability to tap into healthy thoughts because I am trying to be respectful of friends and people who I know both in the immediate first circle that I interact with as well as family and friends in different parts of the country and the world. 
um, who have this pandemic craze. And please not to diminish those who have had sad and, and unfortunate tales, um, but the majority of the cases that if one reads and expands one's um, sources of, of uh, reference point, that um, there are some of the numbers that are skewed. Some of the information is not accurate. Uh, people who I've spoken to who are in the healthcare industry say that those people that they have seen in their hospitals and they're not working nurses, they're in like the nutrition department, are people who are obese who have underlying issues and many times it you know there are um some major underlying cause of health concerns and then the covid came on top of it but that's the number that gets reported so where i'm going with this is you have helped to reaffirm what i have felt in my heart with all of this i'm healthy i i will not attract that i think healthy thoughts i don't go to doctors unless there's something, you know, an annual physical or something. Or this. But I, for the most part, believe that my body heals itself and and my mind energy does not allow, as the French say, microbes, little little microbes to enter it. And um, and I don't believe I have microbes to give out. Um, you know, people are saying, well, you're, you're potentially, I'm healthy and yeah. I don't I don't let that negative energy come in. They're just little, you know, positive and negative Star Wars thing. And my positive is going to outweigh their negative. I mean, that's it. And and, and, you, refer, and you have reaffirmed that to me. Thank you. And, and Doreen is on board here. She's saying good morning. She's saying you're glowing. Uh, and, and again, so we talk and, and regardless of what program, whether it's nutrition or personal training or energy or mindset, you're going to hear me over and over say, drink your water and do your deep breathing. How has that helped you? it has given such a, a focal point of centering because sometimes we get wrapped up in the craziness of whatever stupid thing that, you know, the car doesn't start or the whatever you've lost something that though I'm learning also that having misplaced something is not necessarily, we, we associate it with something not good, but it really can be representative of something very good. So, um, uh, I have the water the, helps. You so, yes. It, it helps. It helps. It, calm me, center me, refocus that what really is important is the energy, see myself, the energized person that I know I can be. Another um, phrase that I, I uh, am incorporating is um, your future creates your past. And that's where I'm going and trying to retrain myself. You get so caught up in, and yes, we need to be in the now moment and, and, and understand the feels, but um, we attract where our mindset is, where, you know, energy flows, where your attention goes. Yep. And, we're forward, and we're forward focused. Yes. Yeah. Forward so, forward. so for most of our work together has been virtual. We are going to be meeting in person in, in November. Again, we met last year somewhere else in person. Um, and one of the things that I always joke about, whether you're here and you're coming for personal training and nutrition, or we're doing something online, I always call our our area, our energy, the island of mis misfit toys from the, the old Rudolph, the mm -hmm. red nerd here, that if the otter you are, the more you don't fit in elsewhere, the more other people don't get you, then this is the right place. So have you ever just felt like a client in, in our, our circle of energy? No, we're, it's a family. And and in in our pods, we get to know each other. We, we share each other's joys. I, I personally get energized by the experiences of those that are are our little nucleus um, yeah. and and our own little family um, and and over that six month period you do get to know each other you do get energy shares you see how the other person has grown and we're there to help each other if there's a little you know a little hiccup um, but that's that's part of life and recognizing that it you know again don't associate it with negative. Yeah, it, it, it's there. The other thing that I really appreciate is the idea that sometimes you have to take a step back to move forward. And I think that's where I am in my life. And, and you've helped to reaffirm that awesome. because I, I feel like, oh, God, I should be doing this. And why haven't I done that? And I've got all this other stuff to, to take care of before I'm really able to get that rocket ship off, you know, the, 
I don't have a go for launch yet, but we're we're on the we're, the rocket ship's on the launch pad, yeah. and, and all the different departments are just getting their gears in line. So it, it's been such a, a joy for for me working with you these past seven months of watching, like you said, this little bud that was closed open up and open up and just embrace life, personal, uh, professional, business wise. And, you know, we're, we're at the end of this month, I'm going to be starting an eight week personal CEO, chief energy officer of your life pathway to invincibility program. It's eight weeks of intense uh, one on one and group live, no pre-recorded sessions. So if there's someone that's watching right now and they're on the fence about should they do this or not, what would you say to them? Do it. I know oftentimes our little voices say, no, or it's too expensive or I can't do. First of all, there's no better investment than in yourself and your own personal growth. Um, at the end of the day, you don't think about the dollars. You think about how you have changed and morph, morphosized. <laughs> Metam yeah. metamorph there you go. There you go. <laughs> own words anyway, so what does it matter? One, one, one of those morph words. Yeah. And, um, uh, and um, and uh, it it's it, don't do it, yeah. do it. Yeah. Don't don't hesitate. It it adds to personal growth and on all levels, and it just it it becomes a lifestyle. Mm -hmm. It becomes you know it's not, and that's how it is. You know when people say I'm going on a diet, and then they lose 15 pounds or 20 pounds, and then they go back to eat. It it that's a yo-yo. It has to become a way of life, and this this has shown me. As you say, go back to factory reset. We nobody had words or languages. We only, as babies and infants, had ways of expressing and communicating. And you have helped to re reconnect with that inner source, and that has been um, amazing. So anybody who can even resonate with this, do it. I, I'm, and, you know, this is a place where in, in this program, we're going to meet in a group Monday and Friday, and then you can choose different levels if you want one on one with me individually. But uh, words have been described. It's always positive. We're laughing. We're enjoying life. We're expanding. You, know, and you forget when when things get crazy, you go into existing mode, just going through the motions. Right. This is about feeling alive again, feeling joy. How can you uh, expand on on that thought? Well, one of the things in the lessons is that we had a toy box and, and, you know, just take out crazy things that in the middle of your day, or if you reached a roadblock or just, just for the heck of it. So yeah. we were all tasked to go find fun things. And um, so I found an old Yogi Bear cup and a little Pez dispenser and, it, you know, just dorky things, but it, it helps recreate the imagination in you, the creativity in you, the yeah. Break away from the mold, and we're so entrenched in boxes and routines. And um, or one of the other things is do something that either you've wanted to do or didn't do enough of. So I've re-energized, and certainly um, one of our 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 pod mates, Schroeder, is uh, a a phenomenal musician and a pianist. And a, yeah. and so um, within this, I've you know, is typical seven years old, da, 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 you know, and, but I do have a, a piano that's been under a sheet cover and I've started to play piano again. That's awesome. And it's, it's just like, it's just an energy flow of the, and there again too, the numbers and the roots and the, so, um, so allowing yourself to get into this creative mode has just skyrocketed more than just the, the diligent, you know, I'm going to work for 25 years and, get my, you know, there's, 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 um, there's a catapulting, there's energy there, lightning, things that we can't see that, that you help us tap into. We, we know gravity is there, yes. although you can't see it. Right. Yep. And then what you're talking about is really tapping into your inner child. You know, once you tap into that inner child again and allow that energy to expand and realize that you're meant to have fun, life's meant to have fun. And if you're not having fun, you're not doing life right. So yeah. 
you know, we're, we're a bunch, we're in adult bodies, but we're just like kids when we come together and we're excited to see each other and share energy and share positive experiences um, and help each other grow, not only personally, but in our business. Absolutely. I can't thank you enough for being here today, sharing your time, coming on here. Um, if people have questions, can they reach out to you personally? And, and I'm thrilled. Message? Yes. Wonderful. So guys, if you're thinking about doing the program, working with me in a program or one-on-one, -on -one, highly recommend signing up for a, a consult and have a conversation with me. We have wonderful people in our group. Once the group, once the group starts, nobody gets added to it. So that's something that's very different about our programs. I keep the group small. Um, and that way you're not having strangers come in after we've been in going for a couple of weeks so that we really have that safe space where you can open up. And I was really amazed in our two day Zoom sessions. We had eight sessions all together over the course of the last two days, how open people, how much they shared and how open they were. And it was just such a joy having so many new faces come in and being able to do that so quickly. Absolutely. And again, for me, the energy flow of the other people, I mean, you're the catalyst, you get us launched, you help create, but then, then, then there's another dynamic that takes place by, by getting the energy and the enthusiasm and, and the different viewpoints of everybody else. It's, it's, yeah. it's a remarkable um, connection that you, you bring these people together. So, so I, I, again, I thank you from the bottom of my heart for being thank here. You and sharing uh, everything that you've had to share. So if you have any questions for Elizabeth, you can always put them in the comment sections or you can reach out to her directly through direct messenger. Yeah. Uh, if you're not her friend on Facebook, you might want to add her because she might not see your message. It goes into that funky other, other mailbox that we have in messenger. Uh, but come back again, folks at 11 o'clock today, we will have our next invincible CEO on board. Uh, Elizabeth will be launching her global medallion uh, business. And if you are interested in our November event, we are behind the scenes right now, finishing, fine tuning, getting dates, getting price. It's going to be in Florida. We know that much. And it's going to be uh, uh, a Wednesday through Sunday event with three amazing coaches. And Elizabeth is going to be there making sure everything runs smoothly. Uh, so yeah, so many exciting things coming. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for all that you do and being you. Thank you for being you. And thank you for having me on. All right. Thank Have you. Have a beautiful day. Bye, Bye all. Guys. And we will see you again at 11 o'clock with our next guest. Uh, all day today at the top of the hour, we're going to have a new Invincible CEO coming on board between now and 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time so that you can get from their heart, hear their words of what it's like being in our environment, whether it's for personal energetic work, for personal training, for nutrition, or for mindset, the, the changes that they have made since the beginning of this year, where everybody else is zigging, we're zagging, and life has become so amazing for not only myself, because I get to be a guide and get to be a part of seeing everybody blossom, but also for those individuals watching their businesses explode, watching their personal life uh, change and explode as the growth happens. So if this is something that you're interested in and you'd like to have a conversation with me, I make sure that we are a good fit. I'm not about just putting bodies and people into programs. This has to be a good fit for you and a good fit for me and good timing for both of us. And there's always four levels so that you can pick the price that matches your budget. I really appreciate you being here, viewing this, and this will also be downloaded and put it onto the Invincible CEO YouTube channel. All right, guys, I will see you again at 11 a.m. later today.